What do we got going on today? We got a low cloud ceiling, slow cloud feeling day in the pit. And it's my last day. So the, the ending of Falco Beyond the Blind is among us. I have to make one episode of all the goose hunting footage and then it'll be done. And then we'll announce the two winners of the two person hunt and the season will be over. And then I guess I'll go home. It's getting fogged over as we speak. Yeah, we're getting. Like I can't even hardly see you. <laughs> that makes sense. Oh, I see it on the lens. Wipe the lens off, it's foggy right now. <laughs> How about that right in? <laughs> that fog is gone, boy. Friends don't let friends wear headlamps. So you got some blue falcons next to you. I film you go get the Christmas on the phone. It starts leaking. It starts high. Like. It's showing off the gun, too. Oh, what's that? That's just my bus. Yeah, elbow. Bam, 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 bam. What is it? We're gonna... I have an idea. We're gonna try something different. I'm gonna do a... I'm gonna leave a gap, and I'm gonna run another group right here. What do you think? Like yeah. this? Like, I was, I was gonna, like, like butt you, and like, go to there, go to there. Like, like, like small groups? A little, little, little crop there. Like, 
Get yeah, fucking around you some and then make you look like a little bit of Baby, come on my side and shoot these ones at the lead. AJ, tell me about the goose hunt. It's pretty fun. It lasted like 10 minutes. Three flocks. Huh? Three flocks. Three flocks. 40, probably 45 with all the cripples because they landed on the pond that was icy, too icy. I had to go in. Swimming. I can't even swim. On Pandora Radio, like he had to go, he went on YouTube, searched that. And Homeboy didn't hit skip it. either. Hell no, we listened to The whole thing. I woke, up, I woke up with that song in my head, loving it. William, are you are you missing gloves? Yeah, I'm also. I have no gloves. I got gloves in the back of my truck if you want them. Okay, what are we doing this morning, Farley and friends? Goose hunting with, with the Purpose Group event in this weekend. Uh, I think means to all of us. So there's like 20, 29 of us here. Twenty nine. There could be thirty five. It's anywhere from forty. Are we pheasant hunting or duck hunting? Are we, are we pushing a, a pheasant field? <laughs> We're going to school. This is our middle school class. Yeah, we've upgraded from a kindergarten classroom worth of people to like a sixth grade math class worth of people. Like there's almost 30 people. <laughs> like it's a little much for an Oklahoma goose feed, but. Especially for February goose feed. Yeah, what is it? February 8th, 9th, 10th. February 10th, yeah, so. But we got a stout north wind. We do have that. <laughs> Hi to neighbor. Hi neighbor. So if you see stuff in the camera, it's because I'm filming in a box blind. It's a really open fence line. We don't have a lot of spots to sit. So I was like, I'll hide in this deer blind. So just be be accepting of it. There's skis coming right now. I'm gonna turn the camera around and point out the window and watch them kill. Their gun loaded, even though they're pow out. And somebody sure goes, like, Oh my goodness, there's geese coming. And sure enough, like 12 white geese are flying right at us. And I get made fun of it, but I always keep my gun some sort of loaded. <laughs> but after I reined out two at like 75 yards, I won't get made fun of ever again. <laughs> Take that. AJ, yeah. introduce yourself to the people of Falco Beyond the Line. Oh, well, my name is AJ. This is my son, Giovanni. <laughs> Giovanni, did you have a good hunt today? Yes. <laughs> what was your favorite part? Um, probably like those 
Hundreds of ducks. Oh, yeah. AJ, where do you live? I'm from Florida, so it's a bit different. All right, cool. cool. Adam Perry. Name? Robbie. Robbie Flack. Yes, sir. AD. Reagan Renfro. How was it? We're out here. <laughs> we shot three and a half geese. So, oh, wait, just kidding. <laughs> There's at least 33 over there, maybe 34. Which is kind of lucky. What is that little bitty lens you've been shooting with? 35. Is it like 1.1? It's little. Just 2.8. 2.8. Final count. I think it was 32, maybe 33. What was your favorite flock? Really big one. The big one? Where they were just... <laughs> Yeah, that was fun. Like if you shot at least once you'd at least get one. Decent. Yeah. Did you think do you think your dad shot good? No, not at all. Probably because he just sent a Barton, what do you have to say to that? He's probably right. <laughs> Made it to Arkansas at the Arkansas Snow Goose Camp. Falco, Snow Goose season, footage drop. Boom! Thank I'm you. gonna be freaking sweaty, sweaty. I'm fixing to show you water for. In Arkansas, has it been? Like, what is today? The 12. Uh, so 11 days. Day 11. 11. Days. Do what? You're out here with your friends, JC you and Hunter. JC, both hunters. Now Derek showed up. So, it's a good thing. Hi, everybody. Hello. The people miss you, JC. Good morning. <laughs> we got two turtle box speakers blaring. We got, we got two turtle boxes. We got about 200, 250 freaking full body decoys we're gonna put out. Southwest wind, Hunter? West Southwest. West Southwest? 45 degrees. Probably what? 20,000 20, geese feed? 30,000? Yeah, probably. Looking for big numbers this morning. Want us on the upland side? Put us on this side. Yeah, that one. We'll go. Uh, I haven't grabbed that one. Um, Hunter. Curdy, <laughs> what's the secret behind the potato salad in the gumbo? You put the rice and the potato salad in the gumbo, and it makes it taste awesome. That's where did you first? Where did you first hear about the potato salad in the gumbo type? Of, where'd you learn that from? Uh, man, that's how we eat it at home. Just big family. It. Yeah, that's how. Where I where I'm from, that's how we eat it. Uh, and I can't eat it any other way, really. I can. Potato salad. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yep. Easy does it. Yeah. It made a mess. How is it? Screen's cracked a little bit on the corner. Mmm. 
Man, that felt good. Hunter, can you recap what <laughs> Tanner's pulled over for originally yeah. this morning? On the way here, he just slammed on his brakes in the middle of the road, and well, I guess he had his phone on his bumper, so it fell off. <laughs> He's like my Bluetooth disconnected. Yeah, yeah, you notice his Bluetooth got disconnected, but we found it, and it got ran over, and it was crushed, but... <laughs> I mean, he can get incoming calls, but nothing else. <laughs> Only incoming calls. He Only. can't make. He no, can't he make. can't. No, he can't touch anything on it. It's just, <laughs> he gotta get a new one. Where do you? <laughs> we have to leave the state to get a new <laughs> one. <laughs> no. To Little Rock, you go. Yeah, no joke. No, I can. Uh, I can call people on Siri. I can't answer the phone. But you can tell Siri to answer it for you. Oh, I don't know if that works or not. His, is your Siri set up like on your phone? I think so. Let's try. Say. Hey Siri, call Call there. Hunter Longcrack. <laughs> oh yeah, Siri works. Yo! All right, hey, Siri cool. works. Okay, I just well. can't push the screen. <laughs> but it's... Say hang up. Hang up. Tanner, you're just gonna be even more old man and always talking to your phone. Yeah, he's gonna be like, text AJ. Well, how are you guys doing? Oh wait, I forgot. Season's over. What are you up to? Let's roll. <laughs> Pretty often when a big bunch comes in, especially over the spread. You need to show everybody out there a spread. What did, uh, what happened at first light? <laughs> Rossi about landed on our, all our heads. <laughs> Guy whiffed three times. Luckily, he had fourth shot. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's like two feet away. <laughs> I mean, come on. There's a pretty morning here in the Arkansas Delta. Dirty cell. Dirty cell. Dirty, dirty cell. <laughs> well, I want this old bad boy off for the viewers. Oh, guess what, Derek? We can see you again. JC, come back. So, what was that last part? Come on, JC, get up there. Into replay. Into replay. Yeah. So that'll be the end of Falco Beyond the Blind until next season, until we do it again next season and JC's back. And uh, the boys will all be back in town. <laughs> <laughs> you missed Tanner. Huh? I, hit, I hit JC in the head. That was my target. This is it, Tanner. Say your goodbye to the viewers. This is it. Look, we got like 14 more days. Say your goodbye to the viewers, Tanner. <laughs> all right, well, we'll see y'all later. We'll see y'all later. It's been a good time. JC? It's been a nice run. Just when I can't see you. Just when I, oh, I can see you now. No, it's been a nice run, folks. We'll catch you on the next one. The longer you've been subscribed, the more chances you have to win. So let's go ahead and spin to win a two-person, two-day hunt at Falco Outfitters. And the winner of that is... Brett Turner. Congrats, Brett Turner. All right, thank you to everyone who subscribed to Falco Beyond the Blind. This season was a blast. We're going to be back again next season doing even bigger prizes. And thank you to everyone who's commented in the forums. Thank you to everybody who subscribed and told somebody about it. Um, thank you to our winners. And if you haven't gotten your prize, we will be taking care of that after the season now that everything's done and finalized. Um, we appreciate everyone being a part of this um, kind of experiment. And I'm really grateful for everybody participating and commenting like they did. It was a lot of fun this season and I can't wait to do it again next year with an even bigger giveaway per episode. And it's going to be great. So congrats, Brett Turner. Congrats to all the winners. Um, appreciate everybody.